Good evening, Mr. Benway. Um, let's go, let me go ahead and see us now. I just happened to stumble upon this one video of yours because it was either favorited or rated by um, Review Tech USA, uh, one of your buddies is named Rich. And I have to tell you that I can totally understand where you come from as far as your um, your comments on your videos. Occasionally, I have to go and for certain videos, put put that they must the comments must be approved because I have gotten some very, 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 very nasty comments from people who don't understand either A, what the video is supposed to be responding to, and maybe that's my fault for not labeling it, or B, that what I'm doing is a review of the best way that I can do it given the fact that I don't have certain equipment. <clears throat> An example is this. When I do a video game review, I do not have the equipment to capture footage, for the com put it on the computer, and then post it to YouTube. So what I do is, I play the game on my systems, be it my PlayStation 3, my PlayStation 2, my Super Famicom, or my, excuse me, my Super Nintendo, which I did convert to a Super Famicom, or anything else. Or I'll play a game on the computer via ROM. And then I will make a review based on that. I, however, do not have the means as it is right now to do um, reviews using um, some form of capture device as in being, say, Cam Studio or Windows Movie Maker because for some reason this computer will not allow me to use it. <clears throat> so I've gotten comments which were very nasty and unfortunately because of them I've actually removed the comments. I usually, I probably shouldn't, but I've done it because the comments were pretty much vulgar. Um, when I've done video responses to a uh, man known as Philip DeFranco, otherwise called SXE Phil, People do not quite understand that the what I'm actually responding to. Again, that could be my fault because I actually just leave the tag, the title of the actual video <clears throat> in there, not the question of the day, which he does, and then I respond to that. However, knowing that I respond to that, people should understand it is my opinion. I don't need to have people criticizing me or even going on as far as say that I'm disabled which trust me Mr. Benway people have done a lot so to say that I understand where you're coming from as far as you, what types of things you do oh yes completely it has also been there was also in a situation with a YouTube uh, commentator slash ranter which okay yes he did explain something in a video however the video cut off at one minute and some odd seconds and change which I explained in that particular video and got ripped and chastised and, and berated by a lot of people that like that particular YouTube commentator and that YouTuber himself, who by the way thought I would, who by the way thinks that I portray myself as God, which can be farther from the truth. We unfortunately have to realize that there are some YouTubers who for some reason like to start flame wars and threads. I sometimes wonder if they do it to get a rise out of us, or whatever the reason is, but quite honestly, it gets old really quick. See, 
I don't have the subscriber base that a lot of people do. I don't give a flying freak about it, to be honest. I do the videos that I do for my personal venting or to give an opinion about a topic or to further a discussion that a particular YouTuber such as yourself may have put out there. But that is all that I am doing and I am not intending to be a prick about it. If there are the YouTubers who can be just outright, there can be, this can be the common the comment, the people who leave comments, excuse me, they can be just outright twats about it. And those people just need to learn to learn to read. When when and this is a note to anybody on YouTube. If you can't read a comment over here or listen to the intro of somebody's video, don't comment on the video. And if it pisses you off enough, don't downgrade it to a one star. Don't um, don't leave a nasty comment to someone. If you're go if you're gonna leave any form of comment and it's going to you feel it's going to have to be heated, for the love of God, at least send the person on PM so this way not everybody and their brother has to see it. And try to be civil about it. I mean, everything that I've ranted about or left a topic about, I've more or less tried to be civil about. So I don't understand where people, you know, get their get on their high and mighty horse, you know? Anywho, I know this video is getting off topic. What I'm basically saying, Mr. Benway, is yeah, I completely understand where you're coming from as far as that vi as far as this video, and yes, this was the first one that I saw. I do intend to see more of them to try and, you know, get a grip of what your channel is like, because I'm interested. Anywho, um, if you want to know, my, I'll give you my screen name. It is Amy's Bro. A-M-I-S-B-R-O. And if you feel the need, to, if you feel like inclined to comment on the video yourself, it'll be right down here. I'll leave it open for you. Okay, my man, that is all. Have a good one.